Though she's only 24, Serena Ryder's lyrics are full of wisdom beyond her years. Hi, I'm Christian with WatchMojo.com. Watch Mojo. Watch Mojo. And today we're speaking with this world travel artist. Your new CD, Is It Okay? Is It Okay? Was a very emotional time for you. Can you tell us more about that? We have so much that goes on in our lives all of the time, and I've had the huge blessing of being able to tour a lot in the last little while and live a kind of concentrated life. So there was a lot of different experiences that happened through that, and I was luckily able to articulate them into my songs and, and write them down, but it's definitely been a, a pretty intense year for me. So you've been singing since the early age of seven. Can you tell us what drew you to music? It was something that I had always done since I was maybe about two, actually. I started singing at home, I was singing wherever I went. It was something that just fulfilled me in a way that nothing else did. My mom was a backup singer, go-go dancer, traveled around Canada, played the tambourine. And my uncle, his name was Bob Carpenter, he passed away, but he was an amazing, amazing singer-songwriter. Uh, so yeah, in my genes, for sure. Now, apparently, the first song you ever performed was Beat It. I was two years old when I performed Beat It. I got up at my, <laughs> my sister-in-law's wedding reception and sang. Oh, really? It's, uh, the only two words I knew were Beat It. Can you tell us uh, which artists inspire you, and is Michael Jackson still an inspiration to you? He's absolutely inspiring. He's weaved this fantasy land and this kind of energy, and, this, and he has so much, he's, he's such an inspiring performer. But um, I've listened to so many different kinds of music and I always have adored a, an eclectic mix of music growing up. Like I like Wham, The Beatles, The Stones, Supertramp, Linda Ronstadt, Ray LaMontagne, Fleetwood Mac. Love a lot of music that's happening these days, like Feist, she's amazing, Amy Winehouse, there's lots of stuff. What do you hope to accomplish with your music? To hopefully, in some way, bring, bring other people into their own power, to make them realize that they have God inside of them, they have love inside of them, they have truth inside of them. One of the most profound things is to bring inspiration to other people's lives. I'd also, you know, I want to travel around the world, I want to meet with people in other countries, I want, I want to, to, to hopefully become more and more a, a global citizen. Your songs are full of emotion. Where does the inspiration come from? It comes from living. I mean, being a human being and, and, and living your life. I mean, you, you, you know, it's, 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 it's very complicated and very intense being, being alive yeah. a lot of the time, you know, and there's so many different things that people go through. And I think that the one thing that, that people need is to have someone to relate to, be it family, be it friends, be it a song on the radio. All of my songs are based around that and even the title of the new record, Is It Okay?, is really about that conversation with yourself, trying to figure out what's really going on. Thank you, and good luck. Thank you.